Hello YouTube, Crevo here making a tutorial. Uh, and I know I haven't been active with these tutorials, I just haven't had a lot of suggestions on what I should do. So I was looking around on other channels and I figured out I'm going to, to do a tutorial on a, uh, some tips about how to use the pen tool and just how to make some simple things with them. Now this tutorial, I don't, don't, like if you already know how to do it, you know, don't hate on it or anything, but if it's not, I'm glad to help. Alright, so I'm just, oh, I opened up a random uh, document you could say here, selected the pen tool, and uh, first off, just some basic things about the pen tool. It is the, like, whenever you click, it's going to be the finest selection. Like, there's going to be no, uh, it's not going to be a rough, it's going to be a perfect selection. So, if you want to like cut something, you use the pen tool because it's going to make it perfect. You don't want to use anything else like an eraser because it's not perfect. So, also keep in mind that if you click a point and then you hold shift and you click anywhere out on this side, it's going to go, go straight across. Also, if you go up in any area, it's going to go straight across. But if you go at a, it only, it would if you go like out here, it'll go to a 45 degree angle. It can only do your pen tool can only go here and up. It it can go you know back down. It can go out or it can go on 45 degree angles. That's it. Nothing more. Unless of course you don't hold shift, then you can go wherever you want. But so uh, this is also going to lead into helping some of you guys make custom text. Like I'll get onto that later in here, but. Um, first off, like, if you wanted to do, like, a simple letter, like, I'll do, oh, it's an easy letter to make, I'll do a, I'll do letter A, so I'm gonna click down here, hold shift, go across, I'm gonna go, keep holding shift, I'm gonna go about, uh, right here, and then we'll go a little, over a little more, and go down, oops, Oh, that's right. Use guidelines, too. Use these and put them on everything you use because they will help you. And this is on a 45-degree angle, so this needs to be on a 45-degree angle. So I'm just going to click anywhere on the line down here, and it will drag it right to it. And I'm going to go over about the about the same I did on that one. It's not going to be exact. Actually, I think that's pretty good. And I'm just going to go back up here. Actually, I want to put a guideline in the center of it right about there and bam I don't know if that's perfect but for now it's gonna have to be and then I'm gonna drag it all the way back down here now this isn't like a perfectly straight line just because that up there wasn't perfect but in the end it's all gonna be the same now this right here is probably one of the worst A's I've ever made but um, you guys get the point if I were to spend a lot more time in this obviously it would be better but this is it, the letter A that I made. Make a new layer. Fill path. Black. There you go. And then there's my letter A. Um, if I wanted to connect a letter to it, like the letter B, I don't know how I'm going to connect a letter B. That would take some thought, but a letter that would go into that one easy. Let me think here. Uh, a V might go easy with it so I'm gonna put a line at the top of it and I'm just gonna start like right here and drag it all the way down there go over to about right here go up over about down to right here I think it will look good yep just drag it over and then you fill path whatever color you want and then there you go. So you have an A and a V. Now this is not good. Like I said before, this is just quick, so it's not going to be too good. Um. So yeah, there's that. And that isn't the way how you make graffiti, though. If you were to want to make graffiti, you're going to want to, you know, click and then you 
click and hold and bend it in all these different directions like you want to do and say you're gonna go make let me get these out of here you're gonna want to make a uh, curve and then you're gonna make a straight line like for example if I wanted to make a curve like this and then I wanted to have a straight line going across you can't do that it curves we do it you can once you're here and you want a straight line all you have to do is hold alt and click this and it will take away that other point making this just a fresh new point and you can go wherever you want with it wherever you want you can make your own curves with it or you can do that Same like if I wanted to curve it again just hold, hold alt click that and it's gone now I have no idea what I'm making here but it's something so this is just a quick little tutorial on how to use the pen tool and some tips um, also I want to tell you guys something um, my GFX pack that I put out a few days ago I am amazed with how it has like 400 views that is way more subscribers than I have so obviously people are searching it up and downloading it but I'm going to actually update that GFX pack. I'll make it a whole new video because it's going to be different. Um, most of the stuff on my other GFX pack, I just looked at some of the stuff I didn't use or whatever. Like I just opened up folders and plopped them down in there because they were a bunch of pictures. Most of that stuff I don't use. So I'm going to use, I'm going to put in a GFX pack with the stuff I use just the stuff I use. You know, it might not be big, but it's just the, my favorite stuff and the stuff I like a lot. I might include some of my some PSDs of recent backgrounds I made. I'm not sure about that because I don't like to give away my work and how it's done, but I will think about it and I will I will at least put one guaranteed. I will have one of them in there. So, uh I think that's about it. So, once again, thank you all for watching most of my videos I'm very thrilled I'm hoping to get by the end of uh, the end of May I want to have at least 300 subscribers and at least 5,000 video views and I think I can do that so that's my goal so thank you all for watching this video and deuces